Okay, we're well. playing get, some really good old get a good score PGA out here at Tour. Uh, they play the web.com here every now and again, so um, we've seen some good scores so, yeah. over the years. But uh, always fun to be playing in uh, Florida. Sun on your back, warm golf conditions. Oh, Where's my phone go? My phone. I want to send you a picture of my beardy. Oh my god. He's so funny right now. He has bearded drag. He has dragon wings, wings on the back for decoration of the leash. So funny. Okay. So this is, might be a new series now for us. Now from a good position in the fairway, his second shot. Yeah, it's a very fun game in general. I really enjoy it. Third shot, looking for a good one. This might be a good one. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a good one. We get spin off. On the green, but still a tough putt coming up. Frank, I'm not yes. saying he should pull out driver here, but this is a long putt. Greens are putt. fast, though. You never know. Good line, good pace. Might have a chance. One second. I'm in a solo match. Well, not a very good read okay. right there. You don't want to let this one get away. This is about concentration and focus at this point. Been a little too much of that, Frank. Just sort of ho hum pars. Eighth hole here at the Wetlands. Par three, 203 yards. You like this hole, Frank? I do, actually, but you have to have a little look at your yardage book because that uh, front bunker will make this hole look a little shorter uh, to the eye than actually what it plays. Something. Green gets a little narrow as it gets deeper, but um, flat. And, uh, well, I wouldn't say easy. Three here, not too bad. Not a huge miss, Frank, but did lose this just a little to the right. Yeah, it looks like it's going to catch a piece of the green, though. Safely aboard. Lengthy putt here of 27 feet. Well, you couldn't ask for much more than that, except to make it. Looking at this par five ninth hole, it's 621 yards. I need to make birdie here. What's the best way to go about it? Well, if you're a long hitter, then there's a chance you can reach this par five and two, Rich. But really, the best way to make birdie here, good tee shot, and then contemplate the layup. And nice. between the first I two gotta bunkers, get this thing there's so a nice section of um, fairway. And that's not going to leave you much in for that first. third shot to a green that's very receptive. So really, birdie can be made the hard way. Wedge and a putt. Good tee shot, good lie. Now, a good chance to take in. advantage here on this hole. Oh, that was trash. You know, this is not hitting in the right direction. You know, it looks like it's going to be in the rough. And that Ooh. one rolls just into the rough. Now you have to decide whether or not that ball's going to fly or not. You'll need to be strong with this. Good recovery shot. Couldn't make the green, but at least he's back in flight. Played this smart shot right oh! there. Frank, you like his chances to walk away with a par here? Oh well, my with a good gosh. shot, Rich, yeah, that's certainly Adrian, on the cards in that. I just and, found um, a purple anything, pump just in a chest. The end of the, end of the hole. Don't tell anyone about it. It certainly won't affect the scorecard at the end of the day. So that's the goal right here. Sick. It really had to Very bounce nice right done, over the right hole. Right on the dance floor. Locked in on the reed and the speed.
Rich, you got to tell me what happened. I covered my eyes on that one. Another bogey. What else? Ready to go here on the back side. We're at the 10th at the wetlands. We start with a par 3, 246 yards. Oh my god, why does my ball keep hitting that way? Frank, sadly, I've been there too often. In the water, you get down on yourself. What's the right way to approach this mentally? Well, you've almost got to take a step backwards, Rich. Um, you, you, this can add up so, so quickly. So, give yourself a little pat on the back, say it's okay, fine. I do not like you're this not, course. You, 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 so, you're I am going you're allowed to, to hit bad shots. a different one. But the big thing now is to avoid two in a row. Now on to his third shot after the last one went into the water. Bro, what the heck? He's a bot. I just killed a bot. Oh my god. Got him. God, these are all bots. What am I this doing? This is EA Sports. PGA <laughs> Tour coverage coming your way. Hello oh again and God, welcome, Rich Slaughter, alongside my colleague Frank Nabolo for EA Sports. I'm Getting so set to go people. to the Wetlands Golf and Country Club. We're located Thanks. along the St. John's River in the great state of Florida. But this could be there really go. good, Frank. Oh, straight at it. That's nice to roll in a 25-footer now and then. Those feel good. But still, there's nothing like hitting that perfect tee ball. Long, straight. Yeah, you can puff out your chest, uh, last to play, the advantage, holes shorter. Basically, the list goes on. So, third shot now for Rory McIlroy. Wow, Frank, he is dialed in. Yeah, that was just some shot on that. Easy birdie. And getting ready for the putt. Minus one, and early going. Strong par five to start, followed by a good par three. The second hole is 225 yards. Two bunkers, Rich, when you look at this par three. In between is a nice corridor, and that's really the line that you want to be looking at going at this par three. Just thread the gap, and you should safely find the green. Birdie try up next. Frank going for another birdie here. Just to get on a real roll. You've got to be kidding me. That was right on the edge. I tell you, he wants to do over there. Just a tap in to finish the hole. Routine stuff for Rory. That's Ooh, a par. Nasty. Fairly straightforward par four now. The third at the wetlands is 160 nasty. yards straight away. It yeah. is 460 yeah, yards. Uh, 100 by the way, I, ways, you can't hear him because we're in a PlayStation party, and unfortunately. It's only 160, but if you're a mere mortal, 280, 180, the hole becomes that much longer, that much harder. That's a good start to the hole, right down the middle. 
Right down the middle, Frank, yes. This is a position that is where a good player start, is absolutely indeed. licking his chops here. Good chance to make a birdie. Yeah, this is when this game just looks like fun. Bunkers don't seem to be in play. The only thing you're really looking at right now is just the flag. This is a good-looking shot. On the green in regulation. Very McElroy looking to take advantage with this putt. Well, I know the thing about bots, Adrian. What? That uh, they, that bot spectate you for a long time when you get a kill. Very yeah, well done. Almost made it. <laughs> yeah, there'll be no stress for the next one. So a tester from four I'm feet. Going that. There's no way I'm going through that house. That's good work. That's a good par right there. Bush campers. Par three okay, fourth, 250 yards, and you can see off camp just camp in camp. front of the swamp, so. Golf cart's not going to get you to the green here, is it, Frank? No, I might need an airboat to go across that. Sometimes. The only way I'll do it is if I'm like at 20 or That's like the only way I'll do it. And I have more mats. What? The only way I'd bush camp is if I had no mats. Yeah. We're the only in the only situation that you. Bush okay, camp. good shot on the dance floor. Boy, this could be a tough one right here, Frank. It's a very long putt, Rich. Obviously, it's difficult, uh, but he still has a shot to sink this one for birdie. Yeah, that's what I thought. Frank, that's not one you're necessarily thinking about making. No. You yeah, settled down, Just, Roy. Uh, no, good putt, though. In. There's no two ways about that. Someone He's putting well. Steady, solid. Oh, under that's par right now. Square. Yeah, I'm dead. Good look now at the fifth hole here. here at the wetlands. Part Someone's five, third party. It's a good one. 635 Goal. yards. Well, then I have to report them. I think someone should have I don't even know where the people are shooting me at. Like the looks of this one. Oh, yeah. Are they rushing me or something? Or are they sniping me? There's always advantage of hitting it further oh than most. Oh, my God. And straighter than most. When you put the two together. It's just straight up a head start. Right in the heart of the fairway. Green light special. Yeah. I... Okay. Spammer. Bro, leave me alone. Wrong club. What happened there, Frank? All the above. Oh, he went in. Pretty okay. good all day from this expect. distance. Just trying to take care of business. I still down there. Wow, he got robbed, Frank. No, it's like k kissing your mother in law. Just a. Oh, he had a score and a goal. Par 4 6 here at the oh wetlands. 440 yards. Did you get him? Water to deal with. Oh yeah, he here, had Rich. a he had a heavy a sniper well, and a purple right slot. And I have like the best foot. The I probably have the best foot in the game right now. We had a build battle. It was a build battle too. Yeah. I ran out of mats. Yeah, he's a bot. The big boys now, Frank. No, nah, he's oh, he might be. Oh, it's a further. bot. No, wait, bots Second can't shot. build ramps. Good look nope, at the not a bot. Just noob. Not a bot. Eh, I guess that's how. Must, oh, must. Okay, oh, it's, yeah. It's, it's not a bot. Well, it's a new. play the game right there. Knock it on the green okay, and give yourself a good in. look at birdie. It's no snack, though. Gosh dang it. There's somebody camping in the house I'm in. I can tell because there's someone looted the house and I, I hear camp. That is amazing. 
Just a sensational putt. Here's another scoring There's a camper opportunity. In that Frank house. a par five. The seventh is just a shade oh under my God. 600 there, yards. There's, and it bends there's gently five to the left, left which longer hitters can obviously kills. hit home. And nothing and like, really I think to be most worrying about with that second shot if you can through. reach. The wetlands are well to the right of this hole. Um, for the second oh shot, but uh, if you want to play with a three shotter, then that's a very safe, conservative way, and really shouldn't cause you any problems whatsoever. So guys, and um, please comment um, if you enjoy here. this. Uh, this is probably gonna be serious. This is one of my favorite PlayStation games, and yeah. Um, I'm just oh my God, we just the, the, the circle. And people are joined. to evacuate. Okay, people yeah. are evacuating. So, if you guys are just tuning into the stream right now. I'm playing my favorite game, right after a PGA Tour, it's absolutely amazing. It's like the best game ever on PlayStation, like a golf simulator. Yeah, very basic. I'm very scared because there's there's basic. a big circle for only five people left. And by the way, I'm at a PlayStation party so you can't hear my friend Death right now. Mm -hmm. how audio oh. works on live streams for some dumb reason. Oh, my sorry, I'm gonna get work. Oh wait, you get those, god damn it. That was a big, bold wait, strike. Wait, do you have my phone? Now a what? chance for a no. big, bold no. move. Hot for Eagle coming up. No. Then I won't get it. If you use the account on your tablet, Okay, you'd have to follow me, I think, and then you get it. Oh my god. This is a nasty game. This is an annoying game. Okay, this is a very good read right there. There's people hiding, and I'm just, I'm just trying to find people back around me. We'll and then see. I might evacuate it. Cause I just had a nasty build battle with like Matt. Look out, fun. As long as it high. doesn't happen to you. Make a little putt right here. Currently okay. sitting at one under for the round. Par for McElroy, which just waiting for that moment. I'm shaking right now because of the game play. Pulls away. Oh, someone, someone's just fighting. Someone's fighting. Okay, so there's four people left, including me. That means there's five on this map. Okay, it's a big. It's just not that big of a circle. After well, this, this one circle should be is safely gone. On deck here. This I'd be pretty happy with that one. About 20 feet away, in a good spot. Goodness. This one just okay, requires shot, a little shot bit at. of focus. Where? Where are they shooting me at? How does that not Where happen? am I getting shot Amazing. at? That stroke looked good. Uh, line Bro, looked is good. That just the did not take that far break. Right. Has this to say par? Good stroke right there. Frank, looking at this par five ninth hole, oh, it's six hundred twenty-one yards. Nine. I need to make oh birdie here. God. What's the best way to go about it? Well, if you're a long hitter, then there's a chance Bro, you can reach this par yes. five and two, Rich. But really, the best way to make birdie here, good tee shot, and then contemplate the layup in between the first two okay, bunkers. Okay, me and some other people. Nice okay. Oh, it's, it's a 1v1. Really it's a 1v1. It's a 1v1, Adrian. It's a 1v1, Adrian. Very receptive. Mm. If so I was like, birdie like, can be made the hard yeah. way. Where do oh, you know, this is so... Nice if I, if I already had right a grappler, would I do grapple ups? Down the fairway. I don't know where Let's the other person We're in a now final match. Position in the he, he was getting smoked shot. the mice with the minigun. So I did the anything anybody would do. So he landed at shark, grappled up onto the roof of a barn. And then, um, because it was up front, grappled up onto the roof of one of those mini, like, hut thingies. And I dropped down onto his build, wrecked him with the scar. Nice. Okay, this is it. 1v1. Win or lose, right here. Game or no game. Can't lose. Frank couldn't ask for anything yeah. more. Uh, just the lie there, too. It is sitting up like it's teed up. Definitely. Frank, really good chance from this position to make a birdie. Yeah, really, the only thing he's looking at right now is the flag. Uh, this is a green light special. I found, I found the last person. beauty, a real beauty. Think, that's him. Not a gimme. But well within his range. Collects Let's go. Two under par now. Adrian, I got to win. Two under. Adrian, Ready I to go win. on the back side. I have one. I think. Mm. So in the golf, three, there's par, and you want to be under yards. that. I'm two under. I mean, it's, um, kind of a pro. So I'm pretty much a pro at this game now. And thank God for that wind. 
That's where it didn't arrive. It looks like he came over just a little bit. Yeah, that one wasn't pretty, but uh, he's it's still going to well, he's still gonna get away with it. On the green. A chance go for with Bird. This one. Long putt here. This will require a good touch. Might be. Imagine. Bro. Be. Bro. Yo. 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 Yeah, the Wetlands Golf Course is a really good driving course. This is another example here, Rich, where the fairway is just wide enough to reward a good tee shot, and then those two bunkers don't really come into play. But Wetlands becomes very difficult when you just start to stray a little bit off the fairway. And then you start to see why those bunkers are put there. I'm watching your live stream now. Declan? Yeah? Yeah, I hit a birdie from one side of the green to another. That was insane. <laughs> Frank, he's cranking yeah, it and banking. Giant drives, a boatload of birdies. What a round. Yeah, these are the days you just dream for. Uh, we know golf's not that easy. But on a day like today, savor it and just keep going. Keep doing it. I mean, he just blasted it down the fairway. Well over 325 yards. Let's see what McElroy does now with his second. There's a big green, and they're going to use every inch of it. Early part of this Why second round, a good approach shot. Now, a good chance for birdie. Well, Rich, if he can make this it's one, hard to see. I add can't it to see that it. string of birdies. I mean, it's so weird. I'm some trying to, like, now. watch it. Yeah, if you just can, it, disconnect and reconnect. That might be better. They can see it. They can hear me, I mean. Just when you think you're going to make birdie. Oh, he's Now, I have to really concentrate Yo, on this that? and at least make par. You don't want to let this one get away. This is if a If you can't see crap, you, you might just want to point. leave the share play and join again. I just want to leave the live stream and join again. One second. A little bit more hope than determination in that part. There's going to be a part. bogey, whatever. You sent the three over. So a tester from four feet. Well, he knew it right from the start. Just okay. a four putt. How did that happen? Nudge what this happened? one home, finish it up. A uh, ball really like, curved. Too bad he ran smack into a brick wall after all those birdies. He makes the double bogey. So on this back nine, we started with a par three, then a par four, and now we get to a par five. The 12th is 576 yards. Yeah, nice blend of holes there that you just referenced. 11 bits I don't think you're on my live stream. Yeah, I'm on it. Yeah, now and I from can there, see. They're just setting up perhaps, uh, you know, 7 iron, 6 iron into a green that's sort of fairly uniform in shape. Yeah, I am. And uh, should present a birdie with a good second shot. Oh, people are, that are watching, they can, um, uh, they can hear am me. Am I moving, like, on the map? Like, am I on a camera? Oh, people are, that are watching, they can... Yeah. Yo, um, yeah. Declan? Yeah. Watch a shot. Oh, that fucked up like hell. I need to give a backspin, backspin, backspin. Oh, it wasn't high enough. What was he thinking there? Wait, Declan, I did my no ball just go into idea. the forest? <laughs> Declan, did my ball just go yeah. into the forest? Yeah. Frank, not okay. where he wants I'm to out be, of the but forest. Not though. out of the hole here at the par five. <laughs> No, but uh, Rich, to drop a shot here would uh, would really set him backwards. Imagine. 
<laughs> so that one settles about 18 feet away from the cup. Pretty good shot. Mm. Ooh. She's at awkward length. Oh, give me a break, oh, Rich. Your mom could make that. Ooh, that's a disappointment, Frank. Trying to get out of here without too many bumps and bruises. This one is for bogey. Oh. So he has that for bogey. I can't help but yeah, think that the double bogey back, back on the 11th hole seems to have bad. shaken his confidence. It's not bad. It's pretty good. Even par, it's good. Oh, if this is up, it's good. Long and strike. That's how you do it. Frank, you've played in conditions all over the world. Here come the winds now. What's the mindset? Well, this is really what separates the men from the boys. This is where you've got to Are tell you yourself that it's an anybody? advantage to you. No, I'm um, obviously, myself. the scores will go up a little bit, um, uh, given the conditions. But once again, chocolate. this is going to suit the stronger player today. Uh, I like the old phrase, swing easy okay, when it's breezy. This for birdie. Definitely when you're hitting it into a head breeze. But um, curve down it, breeze, curve it. Oh. tear it up a little bit, try and ride that wind some more. Let's go. And now one under par. Yo, Declan, you set super shot. 14th shot. hole here at the that wetlands. A dangerous par three comes in at 204 yards. Mm -hmm. There's some trouble out there. Oh, this is where water. you have to readjust your focus. Yeah, you start looking right, right or left of the this green. You see all the problems that could come in and prevail. Instead, just look at that front bunker. Try and fly, fly your tee shot over that somewhere around the front edge of the green. Maybe three or four yards on. And then the hole becomes that much easier. You shot it way. Not oh, terrible, my gosh. Outside is that that went for, uh, in? It's birdie, only but, par um, three. Really, it's not that it's insane. A, a rather poor approach shot. This is pretty common on the athletes. Imagine, imagine. Oh. Pretty good stroke right there. I Just didn't expect hit it through it to the break. Well, it's that sort of distance. Very if it goes fine. in, it's a bonus. Settles in over the putt. Let's go. And maintain momentum. Make those putts for par. Declan? Final yeah. par five on the back what side. What do you think of that weapons. shot? It's Give me a rating. Yards, which is really a five. tempting yardage. A good tee shot, uh, perhaps. Think of reaching the par five and two. But uh, this green, well protected by three bunkers. Two on the left side uh, and one short right. But uh, I don't know. Know. fortune favors the break. I'm going to say five. That was, that was pretty was good. That was good. Why can't you spin for some reason? Good tee shot, right in the short grass. Nice position, short grass, second shot. Ooh. Okay. The Frank, green. this is a position where a player is absolutely licking his chops here. Good chance to make a birdie. Yeah, this so did you say tomorrow you're going to like do a tournament? Bunkers don't yeah. seem to be in play. The only thing you're really looking oh, at. Oh, imagine that. So I can play. watch it. Live stream it and tell That's me a good so I can shot watch right it. there, about yeah, 15 feet away. And a good look at birdie. Yeah, it's that sneaky distance. For birdie. If I miss this one, it's like I still have a chance for a par. Okay, I'm getting this wow, in for par. Got robbed, Frank. No, it's like this is kissing your mother-in-law. This for Just a tap in to so. finish the hole. Did the job right there. Par. Moving to the 16th under, hole here nice. at the wetlands. We're in a 55-yard par four, and you can see, Frank, that green is heavily guarded. And consequently, One second, Adrian. you're really yes. going to have to judge that second guarded. shot. You know, your yardage, and also a good strikes required to safely keep the ball on the putting surface. Wow, Frank, look at that one run out. Just blistered that tee shot. Well, that has to be 325 if it's an inch. And he's set up for his second shot here, looking to knock it on the green. Chance for birdie after that beautiful shot. Makeable putt right here. He is currently sitting at one under for the round. You couldn't ask for much more than that, except to make it. He has this attempt for par. 
solid par to remain nice. one under. 17th at the Wetlands, par three, 238 yards. Frank, how would you describe this hole? Well, it's a hole really that shapes up well for a nice little high draw. See the angle of the green pointing slightly to the right. And nice little draw into this par three. And that'll find a nice avenue, maybe a kick forward, 15, 20 feet left for birdie. And if you birdied 16, chance to birdie 17 as well. You can't hide the flag stick from that man. He is just uh, unbelievable, that, that never deviated offline. Oh, man. And just pushed it. Boy, that hurts. Standing over this putt, concentrating on the read. Routine stuff for Rory. Declan? That's a par. Declan? Final hole here at the wet. Not really if you keep yeah? your wits about it. You just position the tee shot. You don't have know. to hit driver down here. Even a oh, three okay. wood's only I'm, a little I'm short on. If you hit three wood, 250, 260 yards, do the maths, it's only 120 yards left. With that, with a scoring club, <sighs> try and get that inside 10, 15 feet. Finish with a birdie. But if you stray, <gasps> then what? Oh no, we don't think of straying on this hole. This is the last hole. Guys, we're second again after. Well. But I'm thinking about it's gators. Are there gators out there? Yo, stay, this is the last hole, I think. gator on the menu. Frank, really good chance from this position to make a birdie. Yeah, really, the only thing he's looking at right now is the flag. Uh, this is a green light this special. This is the last one. Oh, my God. That was so close! What a display of shot making this has been, Frank. Uh, that incredible yes. approach oh. shot there. The easiest of birdies coming up. Easiest birdie ever. That's a round of 70 on the deck. Second round coverage coming your way tomorrow for our entire crew. Nice. I'm Rich Slaughter. Okay, oh, Declan. And that's so long for now. It's tomorrow. No, you can wait for a second, though. One second, though. This is the end of this round. Sorry, one second. I have to do something. Mm. Well, you have to. EA Sports is proud to present PGA Tour coverage. Hello again and welcome. Rich Lerner alongside my friend and colleague Frank Nabilo. Frank, we've called golf all around the world, but never at a golf course quite like this. Rich, we've picked a perfect day. It's usually uh, up here about 64 people running around, battling it out to domination. <laughs> Frank, this one's not looking good. Yeah, it's certainly not down the fairway line, heading toward the rough. And it looks like it's in the rough there, Frank. It might not be as bad as it looks. Ball sitting down here in the rough. He's digging in. And he's made it onto the green now. You don't want to let this one get away. This is about concentration and focus at this point. Par for McElroy, but you're just waiting for that moment when he hits that accelerator and pulls away. 
Frank, as we look at the second, your average hole was, say, a few bunkers, maybe even a pond. That would be a walk in the park compared to what I'm seeing right here. Yeah, early surveillance said uh, that guard shack, just the right of the green, is actually not empty. So be a little aware of that when you cross the bridge. Green just uh, 167 yards away, though, from the tee. And it makes the green in regulation. Birdie chance here. Very long putt, though. Got to be a little careful if it gets away on him. That was a good run at it, Rich. Not a gimme, but well within his range. I was watching this video. Wow, that's disappointing. Chance to get too deep on one hole and you leave it short. Well, the good thing is he didn't miss it, right? It didn't go past and miss. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. We'll never know. Okay. Still has a chance for birdie, too. Right, okay. I like that. It's a positive attitude. Oh, my goodness, Frank. I have never seen anything quite like this. What in the world's going on? That's a destroyer, and it's off course, and it's hitting straight okay, for the island. I'm back. Look out. Sorry. Well, we're going to have to send them back up Adrian? now, Rich. We'll need a yeah, drone yeah, just to try and find out the exact yardage. Yeah, this is Battlefield Golf Course. It's hilarious. Now has blocked oh, the view. Cool. Talk about a tough defense setup around a green. This is unlike anything I've ever seen. Hey, don't eat that. Come here. The green is that ship. The yeah. green is the ship. Oh, for good God. Oh, it's over the ship. Good strike right there. Dude, right that's so cool. Face. I had to hit the ball over away. that crash ship onto 21 the 21 foot putt set to go. Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. So close. Very well done. Almost made it. Yeah, there'll be no stress for the next one. As this one for par. Two one over par early on in this round. Frank, here at the fourth, there's an awful lot going on. There certainly is. Yeah. Solar panels, uh, radar tower, tower is up and ready to go, so it will confirm the landing on the other side if it's successful. This uh, relative long par three, around the 230-yard mark, so this is going to be all carry. But if land that ball on the green, it will not run through that beach area. And, of course, the trees and the palm trees all the way around. If this isn't flighted properly, it will not find the destination. Seems like too much for just one man. This looks like a job for an entire flight crew, Frank. Well, Rich, we should dig ourselves a trench and see what happens. Just singes the edge, Frank. Yeah, but at least he's burning the edges. You know you're hitting good parts. So, they'll tap in. All right, no damage done. Stays at one over par with that putt. This is the par three fifth, Frank. This one goes back towards that destroyer, which came out of nowhere just a few holes ago. Glad we didn't pick that tower. Well, anything to the right, and you'll definitely be swimming. Uh, actually, we'd have to bring in the Navy SEALs probably to get it up and down from there. Here's to be what they call a commercial play. Very solid. Oh, can't hide the flag stick from that man. Yo, Declan, what do you really think this golf course? Really not much to this. The only issue would be I a lack of concentration or golf? focus. Yeah, it's a So with a make, moves to even par. Pure, even par. This is really like all par threes. <laughs> Frank here at the sixth, a really fascinating hole. It is uh, mid sort of 200 yards, shared greens. Bit like St. Andrews, but because you're hitting it over an island, you're almost going to have to parachute this uh, tee shot in here and get it to land softly. There's a lot of things going on behind to the left and the side. It's like a little village that you're hitting into. Hopefully, you're like going to the even, Good even a small now graphic for a that was of your tee play. breaking. Well, it's almost a guarantee there after yeah. that shot. That's a birdie for McElroy. I think Enjoying it was so, so, so and this is only the 2015 version Now one of the seventh, and Frank, this potentially a This is only 2015. The 2020 one's protected. coming out. I want to say short to the right shirt. there by that uh, concrete nervous. blockade. Green lines up nicely, not overly long, too. And really just a nice shot on target. Just be wary of the breeze, though, in case it's coming off the water. It'll blow it towards those palm trees. And you don't want to get stuck down in the trenches, either. 
Trying to generate some momentum here at the seventh hole. This for birdie. Frankie hey, seems birdie. to have found something. Already two birdies in a row and now another chance. Yeah, it's all starting to flow here. This is uh, really important. He's starting to play well. So finish it off here for three in a row. Partner, look at that. Left here at the eighth hole. You and I could shoot a little hoop. You want to play a little donkey? Yeah, it's uh, very observant of you, Rich. Also, the barracks just up ahead that protect the left side of this green. So there's a lot of visual intimidation on this par three. Follow the sandy trail and this green at the end. Good Let's clean contact. Just nice the result. Job. And a chance for birdie coming up. Really? This is an awkward length. Well done. Another birdie and now three under par. Frank, it's been a real battle out here so far on the front nine. Let's uh, finish it off in style here. There's a great view just slightly right of the ninth green. Look out. Now, that's full of people. You might get the appropriate applause, maybe even a standing ovation. At least a salute. 150 yards approximately to that flag, but you have to be precise. And let's see how precise you can be. Second shot from the rough. It's on the way. Nice approach shot. They'll be happy with that. Just a couple of feet. Nice par to remain three under. Well, that was a nearly flawless performance on the front side, but Frank, we know it's an 18-hole game, isn't it? That's right. Now's not the time to pat yourself on the back. This is not hitting in the right direction. No, it looks like it's going to be in the rough. Hoping to get this up and down here, Frank, at the par three after missing the green. Yeah, it's not all bad. He'll need to be strong with this. Yeah, it should be no problem for par. Been pretty good all day from this distance. Just trying to take care of business. Good, solid par right there. The 11th hole here at Paracel Storm in the South China Sea. What a day it's been playing through these wrecked battleships with all of the obstacles out there. You see the windmills, and now just a short shot, Frank. Well, there's a big green, and they're going to use every <laughs> inch of it. Didn't cover the flagstick on that one. I don't on think the green, they even have the 25th one on um, the App Store anymore. Boy, this could be a tough one right here, Frank. Yeah, it's a very long part, Rich. Obviously, it's difficult. Uh, yeah, my dad's friend gave it to him at work. There's an old cop. Good looking putt right oh, here. this is gonna go in. My this is gonna go in. in. It's using the post heartbeat. Oh! Look like missing. Yo, Declan. Mm -hmm. Yo, watch that. Um, watch the live stream and re rewind like 20 seconds and watch that last putt. Yeah. Frank, this is a daunting tee shot, isn't it? This has to be hit perfectly. Oh, Rich, good. this hole really should be called Shipwreck, that little lone island sitting out there. I love how like, the, the um, in front, tee blocks and, are um, you know, just a different room, color really, grenades. For this green it's hilarious. The tee for the next hole. It's a balance. 41 yards, Frank. This island green makes 17 at TPC Sawgrass look like putt-putt. Frank had hit the green, but yeah, this just does didn't make this spin. does make um yeah, it, uh, the you want to it does make um hole 17 at TPC Sawgrass look like putt putt. Honestly, it really does. It's oh, in nice. the hole. Just a sensational shot right there. Here we are now at the 13th, and Frank, this is a stout looking hole. Rich, it certainly is. No time to be superstitious on uh, number 13. The trenches they protect the back and the right of this green. Anything left of that? Time to call in the Navy. Frank, this one is veering far to the left. Frank made this hole just a little bit harder hitting it into the rough. I would say a lot harder. Second shot coming out of the rough here. Rich, I thought he could get this close. 
That just is amazing. Just a mind blower right there. Absolutely incredible. He made the shot. Frank, now at the 14th and really a simple objective here. It looks like an old sand dune with I've just put a green on top, uh, rather benign. Might just sneak up on you though. It really just looks like green and beaches with a few palm trees behind, but beware. Frank, in golf, as we know, there's short grass and there's long grass. We all want to be in that short grass, but it doesn't always work out that way. So what's the most important what? element from the shot, from the rough? You have to be a little bit more conservative first and foremost because you can't guarantee a perfect strike out of the long grass. So therefore, you have to look around, around the greens, maybe short to the right, to the left, and realize what's involved. And also just give yourself a slightly bigger target. See if he can clip this one perfectly, drive it in there from about 120 yards. What are you doing? We're trying to aim and line up at the ball here. The thing here. Oh, this is taken off on a weird line. And it's going to be in the rough, it looks like. Well, he'll be disappointed with that. No I like doubt. This yeah, this one didn't quite look right on that one. Ball sitting down here in the rough. He's digging in. Stop, 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 stop. Very Here's nicely done, long, right but. on the dance floor. Settles in over the putt. Struggling a bit with the flat stick and a drop shot here at the 15th hole. Not a gimme, but well within his range. Just a little bit of a miss right there. We I'm dropping down the floor. Nice. I'm dropping down the floor. Under. That puts them at four under for the round. Just take a look out at the battleships burning, the solar panels, the bridges, the barracks. You know you're not at your dad's country club anymore. Oh yeah, your teeth flies. Well, this one should be safely on deck here. He's hit the green, but his work is by no means finished. A difficult putt coming up from about 25 feet. That would have been a real bonus had it dropped, but as it is, good putt. This for par. Routine stuff for Rory, nice. that's a par. By the way, this is Rory, Matt. Out of the 17th hole, and as we come to the end of this round, you salute the players because they're out there carrying not only their golf clubs, but the med kits and the meal packs, because this is no ordinary golf course. You have to be on alert, high guard all the time. Frank, this one's offline. There's rough and thick stuff over there. Well, too bad, Frank. That one rolled right off the green. It was just coming out so hot. Second shot coming out of the rough here. Well, how nice. do you like that? He's holding. Just a phenomenal play right there. Now the finishing hole, Frank, and just a spectacular looking hole. Yeah, chance to complete our mission should we succeed here at 18. If anything, you want to keep the ball a little left of the flag. Otherwise, we're off the beach. This ball never even looked like it was going down the field, like hitting way right. So off the tee here at the par three, not his best stuff, but still a chance to make the three. Yeah, that was a poor miss off the tee. Let's see if he can redeem himself. He can really get red hot with a putter. Let's see what McElroy does. 
just an amazing display. The records Adrian, continue to yeah. fall. The game you're playing now Frankie, on App like Store, it's today. on sale. It certainly did. Uh, off swing is excellent right now. Like Stroke is nothing wrong with that. Really, just it's a case of getting out of your own it's way. Like yeah. and I mean, it's like $20. What, is, there, is, is it really that for a PGA Tour 2015? They have to be so motivating. It's the, tw it's the tw 2019. Oh, this is 2015. Mm -hmm. Oh, is it 2015? Oh, is it? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's 2015 because um, it's the um copyright 2015. Yeah. This is EA Sports I'm coverage of the PGA again, like Tour. It. Hello again and welcome, Rich Lerner. Alongside my friend and colleague, Frank Nabolo, we are along the Paracel Islands in the South China Sea. Frank, on a mission here today, what can you tell us about this course? Well, one thing, Rich, we don't have fatigue out there, so I've got my battle gear on. Interesting layout ahead. Uh, plenty of water. The island's there to be ne negotiated, navigated, and you never know what just might pop up during the course of the game. And partner, let me just, before we get started, salute you. I salute you too, Rich. You ready? Ready. Aim. Fire. Oh, I thought he had that. Well, I thought that at least pick up a shot. Birdie looked like a sitter. Now, Pop. This one just requires a little bit of focus. And so just getting started, even par, so far. Now to the second hole, and Frank, I'd be happy to see something which is the normal amount of obstacles say or a bunker maybe a pond uh, those would be rather benign compared to what we're seeing right here on this second hole yeah that's no love shack that's a guard shack there on the right of the screen uh, just past that bridge so this uh, green well protected on that right side of course water adorns this uh, this island green and tons of uh, well, local fauna around the green this is one green you do not want to miss agent yeah. Uh, well, you I don't even much think they have that, any of them besides 2019 on here. And this yeah. will be a five foot putt here. That's a par, and that keeps the scorecard clean, still even for the round. Well, Rich, uh, we've got the drone. Um, it's headed back, told us it's 216 yards to the middle of the green. We can just uh, aim a little right of the gun turret on the destroyer. That should be a good line. And this is the definition of a blind tee wow. shot right here. But you the need EH, all of the modern equipment, the EA the modern Sports telecommunications, UFC just to try to get you zeroed in on where you're supposed they, to go. Well, maybe you can capture the flag UFC, here, though, with a birdie. Oh, wait, no, never mind. I thought you have U, UFC um, 9, and it's only, like, $3. I thought they were really bad. Complete trash. That is brutal. That is bad. NASA, we have a splashdown. So the previous shot into the drink. This now the fourth <laughs> shot. Damn it, put this.
like I'm playing at TP, TT, TPC Sawgrass. Yo, and this and this um course at hole eleven, the Greenden Islands. Today's coverage brought to you by EA Sports and the PGA Tour. Welcome to TPC Sawgrass, known for one of the most terrifying holes in all of golf, the 17th Island Green. This is Rich Lerner alongside my colleague Frank Navalo for EA Sports. And we'll be calling all the to this layout, and you can get huge swings late in the championship. 16 is the reachable par 5. We know what can happen at 17. An 18 one with second, water all Adrian. along the left, that's just one of the most daunting tee shots in the game. You've got three of the biggest shots that you really have to sort of muscle up to. You're right, 16 is reachable, therefore an eagle is a possibility. But also we've seen sixes and sevens. 17, we've seen twos, fours, fives, six, sevens, you name it. You keep hitting. Just ask Sean O'Hare a few years ago when he had a chance to win the championship. And of course 18, one of the most uncomfortable tee shots because you've got to hit it in the neck of that fairway. Out of the sand and back on the fairway. Yeah, good shot. Just uh, really utilized that a little bit between the ears. Realized he couldn't reach the green. And instead, opted for fairway. We can get it. This is not hitting in the right direction. You know, it looks like it's going to be in the rough. Well, that's a, a little absurd that Rich shot wasn't that hard, but it's come up uh, well short. Didn't appear committed oh. through impact. Fucking mother. Mm -hmm. Okay, good shot on the dance floor. Standing over this putt, concentrating on the read. Uh, it's just one over game par. Game early early on in okay, this one, um, one over par. Mm -hmm. Nice scoring opportunity here. 532 yard, par five, second hole, Frank. Considered one of the easier holes on the golf course. What do you think? Yeah, I think you can just cut this in half. 532 yards divided by two. Really, it's two tee shots over 260 yards. For these guys, nothing more than a three or a four wood. And that's why all you need off the tee is just a three wood with a little draw. You disappointed if you don't make four here? Not disappointed, but obviously you lose at least half a shot on the field. Second shot coming up here at the par five. Missed that one, and it is going towards the rough. You have to think he'll be happy with that, given that it looked like it was headed right for the rough. Yeah, it looked like that was the only place it was going to finish, but, um, well, <clears throat> it's a little bit unexplainable. Let's see what he does from here now. Lucky break. Seems to like it. Headed for the fat part of the green. So a chance for Birdie after another solid approach shot. can't make it, Frank, if you don't hit it. Hubert Green once said, 99% of putts left short don't go in. Happened to the other 1%, but... Okay, has it, and stays at one over par. Frank, a nice mix of holes to start, so here we go with a par three at the third. Very narrow at the front of the screen, and that bunker, too, you don't actually see it off the tee, the back left bunker, and it sneaks into that left side, so if that flag is on the left, just be careful. Well, that is an exceptional shot on the green yeah, and in birdie. position for a birdie. Yeah, it's a formality now. So a tester from four feet. Back to par. Okay, the even rim. par. Nice. What the hell? So much focus here, Frank, on 16, 17, and 18. Number four is a hole that gets overlooked, but it's a fun one. Yeah, the second shot here is more dawning, especially when that flag's on the on the left. So you really do start looking at that blue stuff, uh, water.
Frank, the second here at the fourth is a dangerous shot. Once again, this is another example of where you have to look at the green. Where exactly is the flag? If it's on that high portion, you've got to fly it all the way I'm back. not playing Darren Project. Oh, shit. That's good stuff right yeah. there. Wonderful approach, and now a really good look at birdie. Frank going for another birdie here. Just to get on a real roll. Why don't you want to play? Wow, I don't like that game. Robbed, it's hard Frank. to do. All no, you have like is a bow and arrow. And you have to like, harvest trees. You can only harvest like a small amount so of just trees. Just a formality. The game's just dumb. Did the job right there. The game's just selfish and dumb. Fifth hole, good par four, isn't it, Frank? If ever a hole was built for Lee Trevino, who used to love to cut it, this would be the hole. It just looks and screams for a shot that's hit left to right. And that's the only way really to avoid bunkers left and long and that one that's all the way down the right side. Right where they were aiming, in the fairway. Frank, really good chance from this position to make a birdie. Yeah, really, the only thing he's looking at right now is the flag. Uh, this is a green light special. This is definitely not going down the fairway. It doesn't look Actually, yes, it is. Deep rough. You dumb commentator. Pretty good result right there, considering... It looked rough all the way. Exactly. It really did. Just needs to keep it steady here over the putt. Frankie took plenty of time on this birdie putt. He looked at it from three different angles. He forgot one very important ingredient. Yeah, pace. You can definitely fall in love with the line, even with approach shots as well, but obviously we see it more on putting. Frank, what do you think of the sixth? Pretty short par four. It is, but uh, you come out of that sort of corridor and fairway opens up and then it narrows up, bunkers to be around. Very, very few people hit driver here. Frank, approach shot here at six. Good chance to make birdie? There is. You can almost cut this green into thirds. There's that front third, the left third, and, of course, the back third. Playing this par four. Still not on the green after that second shot. That's still not done. Um, a good third shot. Maybe get away here with par. Pretty good shot right there. Even par currently. Drops it, and he's at even par. Seventh hole here at TPC Sawgrass generally plays into the wind, one of the stadium course's most difficult greens to hit, Frank. It's a really weird tee shot here. You have those three little pot bunkers down the right, and then that bunker that meanders once again all the way down the left side. A bunker that's just slightly right of the canal. Very awkward angle off the tee. Second shot coming out of the rough here. Well, look out. This could be wet, Frank. It's heading towards the hazard. Frank, this is where a round can get away. You've just knocked it OB. Yeah, that shot's never going to come back now. So he doesn't want to compile the uh, the error. Getting set now for his fourth shot. Took the penalty after hitting it out of bounds. Yeah, this is uh, this can get away from him here. Getting set for this next shot from the rough, what does the player need to be careful of here, Frank? Well, this is where we're going to see exactly how good they are because, you know, that's not exactly the best lie, but it's sort of doable if you, if you know what you're doing. It's 
So 24 feet after that approach shot, Frank. Yeah, it's um, well, just outside the uh, what you'd think uh, very makeable distance. Very well done. Almost made it. Yeah, there'll be no stress for the next one. So with that, three over par now for the round. Frank, this is a hole that I really like. The eighth, 237 yard par three, just a necklace of bunkers surrounding the green. What's the best approach? Well, you come out through that chute or that hallway of trees there, and this being the longest of the four par threes at TPC Sawgrass, the green actually plays much smaller than what it looks because of that narrow entry. Well, he pays a price for that. Yeah, when you don't see the top of the ball in the rough, you know it's not sitting pretty. You need a bit of force to extract one out of there. Well, that's what the great ones do. From the rough, they use their skill and their strength to get it out and get it close. Now, for such a strong man, a weak putt. Now I'll have to make this just to avoid making Michael Dublé. Just a little sloppy right now. No other way to say it. Another bogey and four over for the day. I'm loving that balance. Well, that was a beautiful drive, Frank. Really good position to take advantage. Uh, sitting up beautifully in the fairway. And from the fairway for his second shot here. Frank, that ball sitting up like it's on plush carpet. Rich, if you and I had lies like that every time, we'd still be playing this. This is a good looking shot. Just a pure strike. Perfect result. They'll have a good look at birdie now. Shouldn't be a problem here, but not a formality either. Almost. Wow. Oh, man. I just pushed it. Boy, that hurts. Really not much to this. The only issue would be a lack of concentration or focus. Let's get the back nine started here at the stadium course at TPC Sawgrass. And break down the 10th for us, Frank. Well, it's similar to the opening hole. Uh, the first and 10th give you the same feeling where you feel awkward off the tee shot. The difference oh, to the not first again. Hole, I always go in the trees of this hole for some reason. Here, turning it into a dog leg. And similar thing, now you're going back across the fairway to the green. Oh, yeah. Now I have to wait for the unknown time of the universe for my character to turn. Frank, now the approach here at number 10. What's the right way to play it? Just avoid that bunker on the right and don't go too long and left. Over the back left is not an easy up and down. Well, the stats say that is a green hit in regulation, but it's not yet a par on the card. Very tough putt coming up. Guys, nice um, I hope Frank, you what guys you enjoyed this on, video. On long putt. Um, that three foot circle. I'll be playing um, this obviously tomorrow. Obviously, you allow yourself a little bit more to further but and further I'm away you get. And but, I'm um, get ready for bed. Just expectations. I hope you guys enjoyed a certain distance. seeing my character and playing on the best field ever, Battlefield. And I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. So, goodbye. So, yeah. Bye.